going on guys it's dave the swole minister you can see the beards coming back a little bit uh, we'll see how long i stick with it so got me a little protein smoothie here and i take this protein smoothie drop it into my cup How's that look? Delicious. This is a strawberry banana protein smoothie. It's on my page. Uh, I believe I have a video of um, exactly how I make this particular protein smoothie. So I'm going to take this smoothie. I'm going to drink it on my way to the gym. So I'm going to the gym right now. I'm going to try to videotape some of the exercises I do. Today I'm going to focus on uh, back and biceps um, and of course abs. You guys know i got to do some abs today. So. Um, yeah, that's where we're headed, so let's go. All right, so first thing we're going to do here is uh, one arm reverse grip pull downs. I like these a lot because it's an isolation exercise, it's an isolateral movement, and uh, I lead with the elbow. I try to minimize the amount of uh, arm that's actually working with this, lead down with the elbow, and just try to concentrate on the lat muscle. Uh, doing all the work here. That takes the strain off of my elbow and uh, it's a good thing. Next we went over to the uh, isolateral low row. Um, again, I do these one-handed. Uh, normally this is a machine that you can do uh, with both hands at the same time. Uh, I like to do it one-handed because again I like to isolate the uh, arm and the movement. Just try to keep a nice clean uh, and lead with the elbow uh, to take the pressure off of the uh, the elbow joint, so just pull back with that elbow. Moved here into the isolateral high row, and here you can see I'm doing it with both arms. Uh, this is a machine that I'm particularly strong in, so uh, I use a little bit more weight here, and I'm a little more comfortable on this machine using two hands uh, versus doing one at a time. And uh, I don't know, I just like the way that this one feels. Uh, I, I get a nice burn in the center of the back. Moved over and I uh, do the upright rows with a 45-pound uh, plate uh, as opposed to doing it with a uh, with a barbell. Um, I kind of like this because it gives a really nice burn in the uh, traps and uh, the uh, the deltoid muscles. And um, you know, again, this is something you can do uh, a good amount of reps. When I think I did 12 reps on this. But uh, it's a nice, nice burn in the traps and uh, really uh, helps to um, shape the, uh, the front delt um, also. So that was a good one. Time to do some biceps. Moved over to the preacher curl. Did wide grip bicep uh, today, which is usually my um, Achilles heel. That's the one that hurts my elbow the most. But elbow was feeling good today, so I figured I'd give it a try. Um, I like the way that this gives the uh, pump in my bicep a little bit more than doing the close grip ones. Close grip ones for me are a little easier to do. I can do more weight with them. But I feel like I get a better pump, a better stretch, and a better, uh, just better overall tearing of the muscle fibers, so the micro tears in the bicep when I do the wide grip like this. Uh, you know, plus it really forces me to use the, uh, the bicep muscle itself versus getting more of the shoulder and the, and the arms and the elbow joints involved. Uh, when I do a close bench, I think it's, I, I, I use more muscles in that, which might be why it seems a little easier to do. Of course, you guys have been on me to get my abs done. I really appreciate that. So I did uh, two ab exercises today. Did the, uh, if you can see between my legs in the mirror, I've got a five pound medicine ball between my legs there, uh, help between my shoes. So this I did for the lower abs. I did uh, six sets of this. And I think I just went to failure on each set until the burn was just too much. Was anywhere from, uh, you know, 10 to 14 reps. And then I did the uh, cable crunches here, cable crunch downs, so for the upper abs. Uh, did five sets of this also, and uh, anywhere from 20 to 25 reps, just until the, the burn got real bad. So this was a, a, a good good burn. Uh, I like doing this after the, uh, the low ab exercises, after the leg raises, because uh, I really, really feel it uh, up and down the, the whole part of the abs. So um, yeah. So that was a good time. That was my day in the gym. So hope you guys enjoyed it. 
Okay guys, I'm getting ready to leave the gym here. So there you have it, that's back and bicep day. Of course, worked in a little abs and a little uh, shoulders and traps you saw there too. So, all right man, hope you guys are having a uh, fantastic week and we'll talk to you later.